Okay guys, welcome to my first official YouTube video. I have no idea what I'm doing. Yep. But... <laughs> so hey guys, welcome to my first official YouTube video. Lord Jesus, what was I supposed to say after that? <laughs> hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Gabrielle and this is Gabby's World. Oh. Sorry! <laughs> I keep breaking character. So... What I'm mostly planning to talk about is probably my car because that's all I talk about, literally. So I've been passionate about cars since I was really young. Um, I want to say around like four years old, but I didn't really start actually getting to work with cars until high school. When I was younger, I used to like help my dad out whenever he was in the garage doing whatever to his car. Because I think that's really how I got into it, was just watching my dad always doing stuff. And then I guess... Here I am. <laughs> Girl, we have Queen Monica. She's a 2013 Scion FRS. She's still stock, so she's only got 205 horsepower. But what I have done are some wheel and tire modifications, you know, just to get it started. So she's currently running on Firestone Firehawk Indy 500s. I'm running 245 4017. And I'm also running on fast FC09 wheels. So I didn't want to go too big. I contemplated going with 18s, but I liked the 17. I think the 17 suits are very nice. Um, but yeah, let me show you guys some more stuff. So in addition to the wheels and tires, I've also got these pretty cool lug nuts. So like a mint green type of color. Um, I got them from Fitment Industries. And then I'm also, which you can't really see, but I'm also sitting on D2 lowering springs. So I've dropped about 1.7 inches in the back and then about 1.3, I believe, in the front. Um, oh, ignore my missing side marker light. If you have an FRS, BRZ, or 86, then you definitely just know that these never stay on. So, making my way to the front... So I've got this front splitter with the winglet on the side, which I actually got from Aero Blitz, so shout out to them. And then I've just got the typical license plate relocation thing that I think everybody kind of does. Um, so the I did get side um, marker side marker lights that were aftermarket. Um, they're blacked out, or they're supposed to be. As I said, the other one on the other side's missing. Um, they're pretty cool when they're turned on. They've got like two, three streaks in them. But I think my favorite part about my car that I've done so far is this Gretti Revolution RS exhaust. It is a single exit. I may go dual exit later on just because I may switch out my exhaust setup. I kind of want a crackle tune or like a pop tune, but we don't know. We'll see in the future. So yeah, oh, just because I know everybody's going to ask, yes, she is manual, but yeah, so that's the end of my first video, stay tuned for more, <laughs> I hate when people look at me, he, my guy turned his whole head, anyway guys, so yeah guys, that's it for my first video. Um, definitely stay tuned. I have some pretty cool stuff coming. I actually did just order uh, an open flash tablet, so I'm super, super excited for that. But yeah, stay tuned and thanks for watching.